I'm here with uh, Parish Nishinga, who's a professional acrylic artist, and I'd like to talk to him about varnishing uh, and why he's varnished and how it's helped him in his artwork. So, uh, hello, Parish. Hi, Paul. Um, so, I understand you've got we've got two of your paintings here. Um, this one you've done in the new uh, gloss varnish, or you've used mm -hmm. the new gloss varnish on the end here, mm -hmm. and this one you've used the new satin varnish. Mm -hmm. So. Um, if you'd like to just talk me through, um, you know, why you chose to varnish them and, and, and how it's uh, sort of made you feel more comfortable with your finished painting. Well, two reasons with the, with the textured. Um, one of the reasons is like you, uh, by varnishing it protects the leaf because it actually is like gold leaf uh, on top of the, the resin. Okay. So that protects the, the leaf and keeps the colour. But at the same time, you know, I use the gloss here in the centre and on, on, the, on the border here uh, just to deepen the colours. What I found is when I put the gloss varnish the colours just sort of got more vibrant, you know, they don't look... So I've got a combination of like gloss, matte gloss, so it's a whole kind of three-dimensional feel. So, you know, the gloss varnish is very good for like deepening the colour. Okay, so I know that you're, you're very prolific and you have a lot of collectors and clients. Um, so in terms of uh, doing pieces of artwork for them. Do you feel much more happy when you varnish the painting so you know that mm -hmm. you're handing over something that's properly protected? Yeah, it's always good to varnish uh, all the work because it keeps the colour, you know, it's, we've got, you've got sunlight, uh, UV rays and so on, and the varnish just protects the colour, especially when you're using gold leaf and texture and things like that, and also with the acrylic. Um, and also, you know, there's, there's two things, it protects the work, but at the same time it deepens the colour. So, yeah, always important to varnish. And there's, there's quite a few different varnishes available. There's a gloss, just, you know, and it gives it a different effect. Then you've got the satin and matte as well, so. And, and this is actually a good example here mm. because um, in terms of the actual paint itself, the artist's acrylic range is permanent, but you, you've used other things such as gold leaf on here, which mm. uh, may not be classed as permanent from, from sunlight. So yeah. putting the, the gloss varnish on here is giving you that extra level of protection. So um, going on to this painting, for example, there is something different I've used. I've used, I've applied the satin varnish on there. Uh, simply not, I didn't want to have too many, too much gloss, but at the same time have the protection. Okay. So that's what I've achieved with the satin and you can't even see the brush strokes or you can't really, you know, see the... See the yeah, I can much. see that this is levelled out really nicely. Yeah. Um, it's slightly taken the sheen mm. of the acrylic off because it's a satin varnish. Yet but at the same time vibrant. it's deepened the colour slightly as well, which also helps. Uh-huh. Yeah. Brilliant. But it, but and it's, it's, this also has UV protection, but because this is obviously just acrylic, the UV is, is just like a, a, an added level of protection that you, yeah. you wouldn't normally get. Because clients also, they many times they always, always inquire, because I saw quite a bit through the shows, and they always ask about sunlight. Uh -huh. Sometimes the paintings in an area where it's, there is, not that we get that much sunlight, but there is some sun, few hours of sunlight, and they're worried about fading. Right. So the paint, you know, I've always used Windsor, I've never had any problems, but at the same time I always explain that it's varnished, so, you know, it holds the colour. Brilliant. So it's not a problem. Okay, thank you very much. Okay, so there's another example of a professional artist using the new range of acrylic mediums, in this case the varnishes. Uh, Parrish has applied, uh, in this case, the gloss varnish and the satin varnish. There's also the matte varnish and then also the varnish remover. He's applied these for his own peace of mind, but also for the, uh, for the guarantee, if you like, to his clients that his paintings are going to last once they're hung up and on display.